It's the whole sound is pretty good, pretty professionally done. Stuart Sullivan is the man who mixed it down uh, here at Wire Studio in Austin, Texas, and Jerry Tubb over at Terra Nova uh, Digital Audio. He did the mastering, and he's just he's just the top. So I can't say enough about those folks over there. They 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 have their P's and Q's uh, all together over there. They dot their I's and cross their T's, and they're proud of it, you know. I know working in the industry with a lot of artists, you know, the producer is always the most important aspect of bringing together a good project. Any project, any artist so, that's actually working so, in the industry. So correct, really. That and so a good correct. voiceover guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, you uh, need a voiceover guy too. <laughs> yeah, and that would be Thomas Vaughn. Thomas, what is your website for those who are looking for a voiceover talent that uh, just, you know, needs someone like you? Right, right. Yeah, it's tvproductions.us. There you go. Now, I'd like to uh, just take a minute here, and I want to acknowledge um, how this all came together. Daniel, uh, help me out a little bit. Uh, can you give everybody a little background on what happened with, uh, you know, Skypecast reinvented, Skype social? Can, can you give everybody a little bit of a history on this so they can understand what's happening and what we're trying to do? I'll, I'll bring yes. them up to speed on what we're trying to do, but you go ahead and bring them up to that part anyway. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, what, what we what we tried to do was uh, reinvent Skypecast, basically. Well, maybe uh, you should explain to everybody. You know, there's probably a, a, a lot of people have no idea what in the world we're talking about Skypecast. So I'm, I'm going to take a wild guess about 80% of the people listening don't even know what Skype is, much less Skypecast. Well, no, that's true. Well, Skype, Skype, Skype is a piece of software that allows you to uh, communicate with each other free of charge all over the world. It doesn't make any difference which part of the, uh, the world you're in. Like we're doing you, right uh, now. Like we're doing right now, you download it, you install it, you uh, set yourself up a username, and you start adding people. Right. What we what we had three years ago uh, was a thing called Skypecasts, where we could set up a conference room, basically, and talk to each other. Uh, we could you could have, have like ninety nine people at a time in there, and you could control who could, who could talk and who couldn't, who could be in and couldn't. But it had its downside, major major downsides, problems. You know, just unstable all kind of stuff like that but go ahead carry on and then and then what would what they did it on the 1st of september 2008 they closed it all down and we have been trying for the last three years to find some sort of medium that was absolutely stable the quality was absolutely excellent and we found something and it's called and it's by a company called freeconferencing.com uh, yeah. Based in based in California. Now you might think, oh well, uh, you know the, the the numbers are a bit strange because they're Iowa numbers, but the uh, the, the, the the company <laughs> is based in California. <laughs> well, uh, I, just, we, I I want to thank the good people at uh, uh, freeconferencing dot com. I mean, really, we we wouldn't be able to do this without them. Oh yes, definitely. Thank you. Yeah, so uh, back in the old days when we did the uh, we had our Skype cast, there were a bunch of different people that had their own shows. Uh, Daniel had British Bulldogs. Uh, uh, Seamus, comfortably numb, had Sexy Chat, which was basically an adult chat, not necessarily perverted, but just grown-ups, no kids, please. Um, let's see, who else was out there? There was His Highness from India. Let's argue. Yeah, we, we had oh. Coffee and Conversation with Keith right. Greenfield. That's right, and Sylvia. Oh, the lovely and Sylvia. Greenfield. Yeah, yes. And who else? There was, um, gosh, there was... There was, uh, there was Terry with, with uh, Pacific Northwest Chat. Right, which he which he has going again now by way of um, Skypecast reinvented and uh, uh, SkypeSocial.net. And of course, uh, I have bulldogs going again. That's right, and I have loving, ki- loving caring, and sharing. The idea, yeah, that, yeah, <laughs> uh, which I started, you know, as a lark, as a joke. The name was a it was it was just to be like a passing. Okay, we're just kidding around here, and it caught on and uh, kind Tell of. us the truth, Mark. I I I I I am lucky. Well, we all factors. we all know it was to pull women, don't we, Mark? I did it for the money. Okay, are you happy? I just sold my soul to the devil on the air. Are you happy? Thank you. Thank you. Hmm. Okay, fine. The truth is out. Anyway, so uh, for the last three years or more, uh, you know, I've had my uh, following of you know deeply disturbed individuals who have been like, Mark, when are you going to get Love and Care and Sharon going again? When's LCS back up? What's going on? You know, and I'm like, I, I don't know. I don't have a, you know, you got to get on radio. Okay, well, you know, it's who you know. I've been trying to bust into it, and they don't want to talk to me. It's like, all right, fine, be that way. See if I care. <laughs> I'm looking for somebody. Look, I'm going to be honest with everybody. This is all about therapy for me. That's what it's about. This has nothing to do with anything other than if I can get myself behind a microphone, get paid for it, then I can get paid for getting my therapy. That's all. I just got to get the voices out of my head. I got to get them out of my head. 
That guy made up the computer. Oh, no, okay, cool. I just much longer. Anyway, so. At least you're not seeing the people that you're talking to. Uh, has it gone that far? I didn't far say yet. I'm not seeing them. All right. Well, I, I don't know. I mean. I didn't say that. All right, Thomas, you smarty pants, you. Anyway, <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I've been looking for, a, you know, what do you want to call it? A venue to, to get this thing going again. Uh, mostly because I've just met so many really neat people. I mean, Daniel, isn't that really what it was about? We really met some fun people to talk to. Oh, God, yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I mean I, I've never met you in person, but we've become great friends. And I want to thank you for persisting with me, bothering me, annoying me with these messages all the time on Skype. Mark, you got to come and check this out, mate. It's really fabulous. Stop, man. You love it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, Daniel. And finally, a couple of weeks ago, I finally dropped in on uh, – Coffee and conversation with uh, Keith and Sylvia, and then I checked out the Northwest Pacific chat with uh, Terry, and, and I was like, you know, this is this is excellent. So what's the vision? Well, here's the vision, gang, for those of you listening around the world on uh, Facebook. By the way, it is streaming live. You can just go to uh, uh, northstarradio.co.uk, and you can actually you know listen to the show as it's going on. And uh, uh, w- what happened was uh, – I decided, okay, well, I'll get this thing going, but if I'm going to do it, I want to do it right. And uh, so I got my people together. I got Kenny, I got George, I got Scotty here. Uh, and, of course, Thomas and Daniel, and now Timothy, of course. And uh, we got a couple other people that are going to try and pop in. Stick of the Dump said he's trying to make an appearance. He's, he's busy bothering through the trash, I guess. I don't know. And um, uh, what you can do, gentle listener, is you can do this as well. Now, Daniel and I have discussed this, and uh, he is willing to put other people on North Star Radio uh, who have, you know, talent. Uh, all I have is a gift of gab and a lot of voices in my head that need to get out. So uh, he's willing to let me do this uh, periodically, and he, you can do it too. But the really neat thing is you could go to uh, Skypecast Reinvented on Facebook. All right, Skypecast Reinvented. Join the group. Get to meet the gang, Terry, Daniel. Get to meet everybody. You meet some really fun people, even Al. You idiot! Nobody wants to listen to you, you dumb jackass! Nobody wants to listen to Mark Mercer and his loving carriage. Thank you, Al. Anyway, even Al, lovable Al. <laughs> Was that the guy? Yeah. From, is he from Arizona? Is he? No, he's he's a, he's, a, he's a swamp crawler, but he lives hey, in Illinois. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna catch him for letting you say that. Now Al's gonna be all over me. Um, he's he's, for, he's from Jacksonville, Florida. <laughs> okay. Anyway, so uh, uh, the, the the thing is, is you can get on, you can set up your own conference call, and uh, you can do your own little shows. It'll be broadcast by way of SkypeSocial.net, and then people that, as the momentum is building, it's not a big, giant group yet. Like some of these groups on Facebook are like, you know, like 3 million people. Well, that's wonderful. We're at the beginning, all right? This is the time to be part of something like this, and it costs, how much does it cost, Daniel? Uh, it's absolutely free. That's right. It's, it's free. free. And it, and, and, you know, it, it, this, right. I, I've been one of those people who said all along, you know, well, you get what you pay for. It's free, right? It's junk. <laughs> I, I mean, really, I've tried it all. I've been, uh, I've been to all these other ones. I've tried them out. Uh, talk, pa- what is it? Uh, Pal Talk. We tried Pal Talk for a while. Remember that, Thomas? It was a disaster. And uh, I tried Blog Talk Radio, which is okay, but now they charge you for it. And I don't really care for it. Uh, you know, nothing against Blog Talk. I just don't care for it. Uh, Frog Talk, uh, Talk Talk, this talk, that's that's you don't have any money. Yeah, but <laughs> shut up. Yeah, that's besides the point. You don't have to have any money. It's a computer. Mark, micro- it's, a, it's a good job I'm desperate. <laughs> <laughs> dot com. Exactly. Yes, dot com. Dot yeah. Com. Yeah. Forward slash Mark Mercer. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to be a participant to the whole thing here right now, but. My kids opened up uh, some of the Christmas gifts tonight, their first Christmas gift, and we're working on this iPod thing. Not oh, yeah. real happy with it. You know, you gotta, if you've got big fingers and little bitty punch keys on the iPod, it doesn't really oh. work that well. Yeah, oh, right. I'm absolutely knackered with stuff like that. I just can't cope. Thomas, you have yeah. That's why I have a wife. She takes care of all my tech problems. That's, yeah. that's how I'm on Skype, thank God for my wife. Yeah, well, right, exactly. good on your wife. <laughs> yeah, good on Tracy. Yeah. The, 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 last, the very last thing that my kids come in with the iPod thing is verifying my PayPal account on her iPod. <laughs> 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 I may be a little frustrated right now. <laughs> yes, and what's the password to that? <laughs> Make sure... <laughs> Make sure it says free on whatever application you're downloading, okay? I don't need anything that's going to be a surprise during Christmas. (laughs) Way to go, Thomas. You're the man. Well, anyway, so look, the the point is, gang, like you can do it. You can get on. um, You'll meet wonderful folks like Daniel, like uh, like Terry, 
and uh, you have the opportunity to set up your own show. It, it takes a little bit of learning. The learning curve takes a few minutes to figure out, but they'll walk you through it once. All right, not not eight, ten, twelve times. Terry's no, no, like, no, 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 no. I'll walk you through it a couple of times. Terry will do it once. Oh, <laughs> yes, yes. What's this? What? Mark, not going to make it tonight. I screwed up my knee. Viking then has me too goofy. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> Uh, and now's an opportune time for him to be in. This is the I best know. time for him to come in. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, <laughs> Ed, yeah, <laughs> get one. Yeah, Ed Michaels is the evil, friendly computer geek. He's a good friend of mine. Uh, he, he, used, he used to have a show called uh, The Corrupted Kids Show. Him and uh, Jamie, and uh, what's he typing here? He's, he's, he's messaging me on Skype. He's apologizing. No worries, mate. Uh, anyway... Um, uh, I can't type while I'm doing this. This is ridiculous. Anyway, so um, did you say ridiculous? It's ridiculous. It's just I didn't say ridiculous. I said ridiculous. What's the matter with you? <laughs> anyway, so um, yeah, so it, it's not gonna be on me. He's still typing me uh, more. I like that the little pencil moves. It, it's typing, but they show a pencil. Uh, next. And, then, and then it erases. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, all right. All right. Oh wait, I gotta ask him. More. Um, listen in on. North Star. Whoops. Or Facebook. Yeah, uh, right, on I, Facebook, right. Duh. Yeah. Well, you, can't, you, can't, you can't listen on Facebook. Yeah. You can only listen by the radio station. Yeah, yeah, so quick. Yeah, where's the link? Do I have it? Okay, he's going to listen in. All right, very good. So Mike's going to sit there on bike and then spaced out of his mind and uh, listen to us prattling on as we try and make our way through yet another night of loving, caring, and sharing. All right. Well, anyway, I want to I want to take this uh, moment here just to thank everybody for joining in, for chipping and helping out. Uh, a big round of applause for all of you, everybody. All right. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah everybody. Hey. Good boy. Yeah. So, there you go. As that I'm wasn't the- quite as big as I was expecting. <laughs> <laughs> That's what my wife said. Yeah. Uh-huh. Dark. Okay, anyway, here we are at Team LCS, and uh, it is Christmas, guys. It's Christmas. It's Christmas time. Christmas time. That's right. Oh, wow. humble. Love Christmas time. That's right. <laughs> yeah, you know, I really should be out Christmas shopping right now. No, 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 no. You're not going anywhere. You're staying right there. You're not moving. That's what I told the wife. I said, I got to go Christmas shopping. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So the whole time it's like Kenny. Kenny's always like, uh, honey, I'll be back in an hour. I got to go do some shopping. He sneaks over to my house, have cigars. We sit around watching Pink Floyd videos, you know. <laughs> And then and she calls up. Oh yeah, I'm just done shopping. I'm, can you stop at the gym? And he's like, he's like shushing me, like Shh, I don't want to know that you're here, that I'm here. Shh, quiet. And so like then all of a sudden Oliver, Hur! yeah, he barks, and she's like, you're at Marks, aren't you? Uh, yeah, but I just stopped in for a minute. Kenny, <laughs> bring home, this. bring home the milk. How many, yeah, <laughs> how many years have you been doing this now? I, you know, it, she knows. You li- you live a life of deception, Kenneth. I do know. Yes, you do. You're in denial too. I have I have full. Um, have right, your cigar. Yeah. Enjoy yourself. Tell Mark I said hi. Merry Christmas. That's true. Oh, and, well, uh, that's lovely. Thank you, Lilo. Also, she didn't know George was coming. Oh, out, so. that's lovely. Thank you, Lilo. Is she yes. listening? Did you tell her to make sure? I, I she's it. got a life. She doesn't waste her time with this <laughs> no. stuff. <Yeah. laughs> okay. If anything, she's crashed out in front of the TV. With and the I don't blame her. Hands. Yeah, that's what I'd be doing too if you guys weren't here. All right. Well, anyway, so um, yeah. So everybody, yeah, get yourselves over to uh, Facebook. Uh, feel free to add me. Uh, uh, add Timothy Abbott. Add Thomas Vaughn. Add George. Add Kenny. Ke- yeah. Mike, you're not on Facebook. You refuse to submit to the will of Facebook, don't you? I'm low tech. You're low tech. Mm-hmm. Right. He comes here and does all the setup and all the stuff, but he's uh, low tech. I think tech. he's a business owner. I think he's too busy working. You know what? I think you're right. He's a workaholic. <laughs> Look at him. He's got. He's still got his back brace on from work. <laughs> he won't even take it off to sit out of me. He wouldn't take it off while we're eating dinner. I'm like, take that thing off. You can't eat food like I do it all the time. <laughs> <laughs> he's going to have acid reflux. You watch. Anyway, so it's Christmas time. Yes, it is. At loving, caring, and sharing. And uh, let's see. Well, that's the show for tonight. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> well, you didn't even touch half the things you told me you were going to talk. About. I know. I got a lot. Of, I got a lot of stuff. There's so much stuff. You know, trying to keep it organized. Two hours is not enough. No, uh, you know, actually, it's not. But we're going to try and cram it in. We're going to do what we can here. And there's always a possibility we could go into an overtime. But I'm going to try and keep it at two hours, just to be <clears throat> professional. So. Anyway, uh, where's the thing? No, that's not it. There we go. Okay. I've just got to remind myself what the heck I wrote earlier. 
make notes to myself and I forget to read them. Oh, yeah, don't forget. You want to tell everybody, go to CoyoteCigarPost.com. Go to ReachGingerBrew.com. Get yourself some ginger brew, ladies and gentlemen. It's a wonderful, the finest made ginger ale made in the world. And you can get it and drink it, and you'll be just like me. 